Uncle Sam with his finger up his nose. Here shows mother wanted for child abuse. And you can put your mother's, fill your mother's name in right here. They're called the Garbage Pail Kids, a parody on Cabbage Patch Dolls, but parents aren't laughing. And he's sitting there with a, with a button in his lap ready to, or he does, he blows his head off, and when it comes off, it looks like the atomic bomb. It looks communistic. It looks like maybe someone is trying to break the American family. The bubblegum and cards are made by a Pennsylvania company, but they're being sold locally at 7-Eleven stores in Toys R Us. Parents are banding together to get the product off store shelves. The protest is being organized by parents of children who attend the Daybridge Learning Center in Duncanville. Parents who've put their concerns on paper in the form of a petition. This is a petition that some of the parents have decided that we would like to circulate to try to get the garbage patch kids taken off of the market. They depict violence and destruction of children and by children. It defaces different United States monuments and Uncle Sam. Seven-year-old Joe Tucker says the garbage pail kids are popular at his school. Everybody in my classroom, they've always wanted them. Duncanville parents will circulate the petition this weekend and take it to local distributors next week. Officials at 7-Eleven and Toys R Us were not available for comment today. Cindy Kirkendall, Channel 5 News. And these were the ones that were really bad, too. <clears throat>